A mother blames bullies for pushing her son so far that he took his own life. Tonight, she sits down with Five on Your Side to send a message to students and families about why it's important for everyone to prioritize kindness. The student was an eighth grader in the Rockwood School District. Our Ryan Henson talked to his mom about her frustrations and what she wants to see changed. It crushed him and it was constant. You know, it was, he didn't want to go to school anymore. Sheila Mueller's son, Kloss, took his own life this past weekend. He was just 13 years old. So Kloss was hilarious. He was a fun kid to be around, very kind hearted. He was the best big brother and a huge help for me. His mother blames bullies for pushing her son to this point, many times attacking a vulnerable point, the loss of his father when he was young. So a kid walk up, walked up to Kloss and said, knock, knock. And he said, who's there? And they said, not your dad. And it crushed him. She believes the bullying started years ago, but really noticed her eighth grader pulling back in the past few years. My son was reaching out for help. And he, he got nothing. I'm just, I'm, I'm baffled at how, how this has been handled. Sheila Mueller says the school needed to do more for her son and needs to do more for other students still being bullied. The district does have an extensive list of programs that offer students and families help with bullying and mental health concerns. They partnered with a group called Hazel Health, which gives students access to counselors. They've also hosted seminars for students and have peer-to-peer -peer mentorship programs that allow students to help their classmates. But like many districts, the issue of bullying and student suicide still impact Rockwood. Miller says fixing this problem starts at home. And if your kids are bullying other kids, we need to talk about what Miller that has looks another like. son who's five, and she will teach him the same things that gave Kloss so much strength for so many years. I, I tried to teach him to, to overcome things and to be resilient, and that, you know, sometimes people don't know that words hurt. Ryan Henson, five on your side. School leaders sent a statement saying the Rockwood School District is heartbroken over the loss of one of our students. Klaus Mueller was in the eighth grade at LaSalle Springs Middle. Our sincere thoughts and sympathies are with his family, educators, and friends who knew and loved Klaus. The Rockwood School District has added additional counselors at LaSalle Middle School this week. They are there to help students and staff cope with the loss. If you or someone you know needs help, it's available 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Just call the Suicide Prevention Lifeline at one 800 273 8255 Hey,